control because it just gives you so much more leeway. Gives you complete control of the hockey game. All you need at this point is to play decent D, and you've got a W. Wow. To Kovalev. Nice work. Needs to move it to Campbell. Campbell's going to cover that one up for a faceoff. Over three minutes left, second period of action. Howe's skull has given them a comfortable advantage. Front of the net. Through center to Smith. All alone on the breakaway. To Odeline. Big time effort. That's the offensive zone. Good save. Great positioning for that pad save. Pass along the... Here's a breakaway. Second period almost done. Ryan to Messier. Oh, look at that move. And that's the end of the second period. Three zip at the end of two. A very one-sided physical game so far. Getting out here, Gary, but just about getting run out of the building. That's how our goalie, like a third goal. I don't know about the third goal. We kick off the third period with that face off. Snap that one. Off the blocker. That puck was up for grabs. He's got it. Wrists it. Oh, that was a stop made with a glove. Unbelievable. Well, we're going to see if these guys want to do anything more than just chirp at one another. Gets that puck. Scores! And that's going to be four that are unanswered. Howe's going to get an assist on a goal that increases that lead. Gary, this is just unselfish play. I mean, what a great passer. That is the goalie for the phone. Good with a goal scored at the start of the third period, the offense, which we saw working so well early in the game, continues. Yeah, and if there was any chance, or at least any thought the other team had of getting back into the game, they can forget about it. Big time shot. I can get a goalie. I mean, why do they always have to make it? It's the goalie that's the, the difference maker when it comes to ice coping. It's always that way. It's so fucking fucked up because he's so critical to the team. He's got it on the stick. He's out in front on a break. It's always, let's, nice let, let's give that. Legs. The better team, the really bad goalie. Well, tonight it looks as though that point shot's the one he's going to be using to create chances to score. And, Gary, I think this guy is always dangerous because he's not looking to pass. He is looking to shoot. Might be a bit predictable, but he gets his share of points this way. Ryan. Trying to work that out. Hey, how about that move? He kind of dangled a little bit. You'll see that on NHL tonight. One more puck on that stick. Nice move. He'll carry it now. Picks up that rubber along the line. Off the blocker. Ow. Collision along the wall. That's how you get it done. The Kovalev. With the puck on the stick, into the offensive zone he comes. Messier to Smith. That ends that offensive attack. Defenseman hanging on on the breakaway. Good defense. The signal, a penalty shot on this whistle. 
Sometimes when you're in desperation mode, you lose control of your stick. I think that's what happened on this. Score! He's got a shot at a trick. That's his second. Scott to Whitney. Great scoring opportunity. Trouble is, we've said that a number of times in this game tonight, and he still has nothing to show. Oh, wow. Use of the blocker. Pokes that away. Long reach. Breaks it up in the defensive zone. That's a goal scoring effort right there. Snatch that one. Nice glove save. Ryan. Fires it. Picked away with the pads. Rebound shot. Pad save. To Kovalev. He's had a couple of goals in this game. That's why they've got that big lead going. Ryan's being assessed a two-minute minor tripping. Gamble's freezing up. We've got ourselves a fight, but it's the guy who stepped in. The cuffs end there, and I'm not sure how you define what happened. Pretty wild. He he obviously wanted to fight. I think if he had just stood on the sidelines, the fight was going to happen without him involved. He'll clear it out. He picks up the loose puck. Smith, neutral zone. Good stand up boat check. Gets that one out of there in the shorthanded effort. Good play. They'll start this rush from their own end. Loses possession of it. Double F's play tonight has been on the bad end of things. Has he been looking up a lot, or is it my imagination? Goalie makes the save. Goaltender might want to think about keeping that one in his glove. He got rid of it. Up the wing to Schultz. To Odeline. Quick shot. Not a very good decision. Save made on a shot that never had a chance of going in. Smith's effort is another turnover. How many times? And this with his team trailing. He's alone. Breakaway. Shot scores. Send in the hats. That's his third of the night. Final game. Pretty much Funny how thumbs up. NHL 13. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, it's also funny how all of their team play scores are terrible. Yeah. I like, don't they're really not care doing any of the work. I mean. Really? I With that last know. goal, you've gotten this game pretty much where you want it here in the third period. And all the coaches want here is for their guys to be good and responsible defensively the rest of the way. Chalk that one up as a bad save. Bouchard's control of the puck tonight. He has done that all night long. And Gary, he's been on the ice at the right times. That's why he is doing such a great job in the plus-minus category tonight. To Smith. Good wrist shot. Oh, man. You talk about putting the glove to good use. What a save. Picks that off. Ryan. Into the neutral zone. Ryan. And we're almost done. Here's the third period's concluding. And uh, wow, has this game gone one way? There's a battle. Dig it in. Shot. Save. Wants to keep the clock going, so he moves it. Ryan clears the length. Ryan's plus-minus numbers tonight, Bill, are terrible. Well, I don't know how anybody was going to be a plus player in a game like this. He'll move it himself. Breaks that up with a good defensive play. Ryan. Four checking has been successful. You can count the turnovers and know how good it's been. Goalie will get that one covered. Looks like we may have one break up. All right, fisticuffs, let's go.
Bill, here in the third period, uh, we know on the scoreboard we've got a blowout, and I'm wondering uh, we're going to have more of this. Uh, we could, and I know one thing. The fight's not going to change the momentum or change the score. I think it's all about the next time these two guys meet. Send a message. That's what happened here. Oh, here we go. Uh, two of them are lining up. We're ready. 19 minutes, 54 seconds. I wonder, though, are we going to get through this third period without some more of this? I don't know. you got to know the linesmen, the refs are going to be really watching this. To me, this was about sending a message, putting it in a bottle, floating it out to sea, and seeing if it floats up on shore for the next time these two teams meet. Well, we often talk about the line between winning and losing being very fine. The line was about eight miles wide.